Hi P2, I am going to show you how to play what I call gumball math. And this is either a subtraction or addition game, and it's just a fun review game. So I have another video uh, that I showed you how to make this gumball math all by yourself. And so I've made it, and now I'm gonna show you how to play the game. So I have a piece of paper. I folded it in half. Let's do this one. So you take a plain piece of paper, fold it in half. Then you're gonna fold it in half again. All right, so nice, long, hot dog buns. Then you will fold it in half and fold it in half. So you folded it um, twice in both directions, all right? Remember, if at any time I go too fast for you, pause the video. Okay, so now you have all these squares, okay? So you have all these squares. I'm gonna fold it in half so you can see my paper and the board at the same time. Okay, so for each square, you're gonna write your um, either addition or subtraction that we're gonna use here. So you see it all right there? I'm going to get out my um, black marker so it's easier for you to see. All right, you need your gumball math, a piece of paper, a pencil or marker, um, whatever you wanna use, and a die. Okay, so you're gonna roll, and I have six. Now, if I want to work on addition, I'm going to say six, and I'm going to do an addition sign, and then wherever this lands is what you're going to do. One equals that seven, okay? So you're going to roll it on the gumballs, okay? So this one is six plus one. Now I can do subtraction. I could do six minus, I landed on a one again, one, and that equals five. Okay, so let's go through and we'll do this whole paper together. So again, you're gonna roll it on here. So I have a two and a seven. I wanna work on addition, so I'm gonna add seven plus two equals, well, I start with seven in my brain and go eight, nine. You know, let's say I want to work on subtraction. I'm going to start with seven and then I'm going to subtract two. Remember, use your fingers. Seven, take away two, I have five left over. All right, let's roll again. Six and an eight. Again, I can do subtraction and addition on both. So let's say I want to start with my six and I wanna add my eight. That's a tricky one, because we know that's gonna be bigger than 10. So let's start with our big number, eight. Let's add six, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, All right? Eight plus six is 14. Now we wanna do subtraction. We always start with our bigger numbers. So we start with eight, we subtract six, Eight minus six is two. All right, let's roll one more. Five, and I landed on seven. So seven plus five equals seven plus five. Start with seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Now we're gonna start with seven again. Seven minus five equals Start with seven, take one, two, three, four, five away. I have two left over. All right, P2, so that is just a fun way to practice addition or subtraction. You can use this again and again, and again, just roll your dice and whatever it lands on, this is five and five. So I could do five plus five is 10, or five minus five is zero. Have fun.